welcome back to my channel. Well, welcome to my channel. Let's not do the welcome back because I've been gone for such a long time. But welcome to my channel. As you can tell from the title, today is going to be a work day in my life. I'm going to take you guys along with me working in theater, working full time on Broadway. I would go in and explain everything and like where I was, but I just launched my podcast. Wait, can I introduce myself? I always do this. I do this on the podcast too. Hi guys, I'm Cami. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Like I was saying, I would take the time to explain everything, but I'm kind of late to work. Um, great start to this video. But I also explain everything on my podcast that I just launched called Dining Room Dissertation. Explain the name and everything in my like come back to all of my creative projects on there. So go listen to that. I'm so excited. I launched it yesterday and an episodes come out every Monday. But something got like messed up in distribution, so I had to wait a day. But it's out. Go listen to it. I'll leave the link down below, and the link is in my on my Instagram page on my bio. Um, and go follow the podcast Dining Room Dissertation. These are too small. Just a little to sum it up. Um, I just graduated from Temple University with a bachelor's in theater and advertising. And I do marketing for a theater company. Yes, I'm using both degrees, whatever. You'd have no idea how many times people say that. And like every time somebody asks me what I studied and like where I work, they're like, oh my God, you're using both degrees. I'm just like, yes. And it's funny because the people who are most excited are the people I work with. And it's like, you work here. Like, you know, there's careers in the theater I don't know a little explanation of what I do I do marketing for a theater company we have theaters on Broadway and two off-Broadway theaters and I decided to film today because today's a different day from what I normally do normally I go straight to the office but today I'm going to our off-Broadway theaters to get a thumb drive that we can update for <laughs> the end of well it's not the end of the season but the end of the semester I never explained what I do I'm in charge of like the playbill and you know making sure things are sized right to go to different <clears throat> excuse me media vehicles and what else do I do I order the sliders which are the names that you see outside theaters that it's like now starring and all the names of the cast. I'm in charge of the website um, and creating that so that's a little rundown of what I do. So like I said on normal days I go straight to the office but today I'm going straight to the theater so I thought I'd show you that. And each day is different. Things happen and you just have to go with the flow so I don't have a set work day so I could show you like five of these and they'd all be different. I'm a little late, but it's fine because I have to go to the theater, so I was going to be late anyways. Funny thing, I'll do it while I'm packing my bag. I live in New York City. I don't Uber here. I Uber a lot in Philly because it's cheaper, but I don't Uber at all in New York City. I only Uber if it's a like work event, but <clears throat> what is with my voice? I buy an unlimited monthly Metro card because I'm not just taking the train to work and then taking taking the train back home. I'm, you know, taking the train to Staples to pick up a poster to drop it off at the theater and all these things. So I have an unlimited and I used it yesterday morning and it was working just fine. And then I go home at the end of the day and it kept on saying, please swipe. And then I like ask the guy the MTA person, I don't know. What's wrong? And he's like, the magnetic strip is broken. So. I had, what is today? The 20... It's the 26th. I have three more days left of that unlimited. And now I have to buy a new one. Which kind of works out because I have three weeks left at that position. My marketing position is only for like a certain amount of time. only have... 
three weeks left in December so I was debating like do I want to buy monthly for three weeks but now it's four weeks so now I need to buy monthly so that's freaking awesome so I just popped on this blazer I'll show you guys a real outfit of the day so I just popped on this blazer from Primark this turtleneck is from H&M necklace is the moon necklace from Missouri and then I just have on these leggings from Shein and sneakers from Express. My office is pretty casual. It, it's theater. Like, some people wear jeans. Some people wear their college sweatshirt. Like, it's a very chill day. And these are, like, my work leggings. Like, I have lazy leggings. Girls know this. Like, you have your lazy leggings, but then you have, like, your lazy structured work leggings. Those are these. Yeah, and then I, what is happening with my hair? Um, I don't know what's going on with my hair, but we're gonna leave it. But I'm just going to hop on the train and I will take you guys to work with me. so long it literally all oh, my batteries died what amazing um but yeah it took longer to get here than i thought um the train sucks but that's new york city now to go get starbucks and actually go to work died like I was saying in the last clip but I really thought today was gonna be something special it really can't be now that all the shows have opened um, and for those of you that don't I'm just gonna put y'all right here for those of you that don't know what that means because I was telling my mom all our shows opened um, the other day and she's like I don't understand what you're saying but for those of you that aren't in the theater world that means like all the shows we had for that amount of time span have gone up on Broadway so they're all playing or they've closed which means they're not playing anymore. All three of our shows went up, two of them closed, we have one left. I did the most when things were just starting and I ran around the most and things were like more hectic when the shows were in previews which means you know before opening night and things like that but now we're just waiting for things to be done. So I just spend the rest of the day doing my cover letter and resume just updating that because like I said I'm leaving that position ends in December so I need to find a new job but I hope you guys enjoy this little sneak peek into my life what it's like working on Broadway working full-time for a theater company sorry that this wasn't the most you know action-packed day but I will see you guys next week with a new video don't forget to like this video and subscribe share it comment, all the good stuff, and I will see you guys next week.